I welcome you into the space of Comenos Gallery. We have been in Key Biscayne for 29 years. That means that we opened the gallery in 1982. I would like to introduce you to some of the artists and I hope that you can come and visit us. We are open Monday through Friday from 10 until 6 and Saturdays from 10 until 3. I will invite you to walk along with me so you can get acquainted with the artists that I represent. Uh, here we have Jordi Prat Pons, he is an artist from Barcelona. Uh, the way he does his pieces is he uses paper as the main ingredient in the pieces. He goes to the studio and rips papers from events that he finds in the streets and reconstructs the papers in a way that he would like. And then he reconstructs also the bottles using the collage of every bottle uh, that he has. Uh, here we have another piece, another diptych by him. Uh, same technique, uh, reproducing, uh, reconstructing the bottles on the canvas using the labels of uh, the different uh, bottles. Another artist that I would like you to introduce to is Meredith Gwinning, which is this painting here. Uh, she's uh, from Sydney, Australia and she had lived in Key Biscayne for the past five years. Uh, she had her first one woman show here in the gallery and in the month of March. And this is a gouache with collage of tin cans that she cuts out in order to give the idea of the water reflection. Another artist will be Olivier Benjamin with his furniture pieces. At the moment we have a, in the gallery this cocktail table. Uh, he does pieces according to the client's needs also. Different sizes, different colors, and we have this beautiful table also by him, this is a square table. And this sculpture, which is the bronze, and that we call the relationship sculpture, because it is interactive, you can play with it. So it moves, so it's supposed to be a couple, and if you are having a good day, you can look at each other. If somebody doesn't want to talk to the other person, then maybe you can turn uh, the face out. And uh, he has done this in a bronze. We have one that is blue, and we have one that is silver. These ceramic plates are by artist uh, Joaquin Gonzalez, who was uh, born in Cuba. He lives here in Miami now and he will have a show at the gallery. This piece right here is by artist Colette Virango, who works and lives in Paris. Uh, we had an exhibition of her latest work in the month of March also. And uh, this is a manipulated digital photograph. So in order for her to come up with this image, she has used at least five different photographs that she has combined into one to get this. This piece right here is by artist uh, Victoria Quijano. The name of the piece is uh, Regata, and she is uh, from Colombia. This piece is by artist Jose Bedilla, who was commissioned by the uh, village of Kibiscane to do some designs for the plazas that raise our sidewalks. I have two pieces. This is one, and uh, follow me, I'll show you the other. This is by Jose Bedilla. Uh, this is a stainless steel and it has been mounted on a black granite. Sure. Another artist that I would like to introduce you is Patrick Hughes. Patrick Hughes is a British artist working and living in London. He is the creator of Reversective, an optical illusion on a three dimensional surface where the parts of the picture which seem the farthest away are actually physically the nearest. This is another piece by artist Jordi Pratt Pons. It's one of the biggest pieces that he has ever done. It's uh, two meters by two meters or uh, uh, six feet by six feet. Again you can see the work of uh, 
decollage, uh, which is the main ingredient in this piece. He uh, spends hours and hours in his studio uh, cutting the uh, paper and trying to do the composition that he wants to achieve. In this piece, we can see that he has used oils, sand, varnishes, and again, the labels from the different bottles that he reconstructs in the canvas. Thank you for taking the tour of Comenos Gallery. This is just but a small portion of the artists that we represent. I hope that you can uh, have the time to come and visit us. And uh, thank you again for being with me today.